So you want to start a t-shirt business and you want it to be passive. You want to be able to say, hey, I've been able to start a business and I don't even have to have inventory. But there's some lingering questions that you have when it comes to knowing what's going to be the best print provider that you're going to use when it comes to your print on demand business. What is up Define Squad? Welcome and welcome back to another video. It's your girl Alex and on this channel we talk about having a business mindset with self-made personality. So if you are wanting to start a print on demand business specifically with Printify then this video is going to really help you bridge that gap in knowing what print provider you should go with. Now before I dive into this video and review with you the two shirts that I'm going to be showing you guys more up close. I just wanted to share with you some basic information that's going to help you get started. When it comes to using Printify you need to make sure that you have really high quality artwork. That's going to really be important you guys when it comes to having the best quality t-shirt that you imagine in your in your business right so when it comes to knowing what's the best print provider where should I start which one should I go with that's all gonna be things you need to know but you need to make sure that your artwork is definitely good enough and has a really good quality so that way you can experience the best high quality print for your t-shirt so the two print providers that I'm gonna be talking about today are gonna be from the dream junction and Swift POD I love using print on demand now where I am in my business I'm more established and it really helps me maximize my time when it comes to my marketing and my branding which are still two important factors in running any business okay but what I do allow is the peace of mind I have knowing that my artwork is really bomb so that way when it comes to me making a mock-up and having Printify fulfill it for me that part is so stress-free now for me and I don't have to worry about anything but just like you when I got started I had to figure out which print provider was going to be the best for me and my business these videos I feel like when you see them everybody gives their biased opinion and that's okay because if you're dealing with print on demand you want to make sure that there's someone out there really telling you the things that you need to know okay so I'm going to go ahead and review with you guys two shirts that I have right here and give you a really good experience of the quality you can see it for yourself and you can understand how t-shirts are going to look when it comes to using a print provider with Printify. So let's get a little bit closer. Okay so now it's time to get a close up and I have my shirts here side by side so that way we can compare. Obviously these are black shirts and you guys know that sometimes you get a little bit of lint on your shirt but that's no biggie. So let's go ahead and start with this one. So this one was printed by the Dream Junction and if you guys are new to like t-shirt printing methods this particular method is called DTG which means direct to garment so literally imagine a printer directly printing on your t-shirt that's what that means okay and so I just want to let you guys see like how the white font looks on the shirt and how the colored font look on the shirt so this is really up close you guys can see all of the detail and this is how direct to garment will look I'm not sure what your expectations are when it comes to how t-shirts should look but as far as the actual application this is what direct to garment looks like so it gives you this very like grainy look when it comes to your t-shirts and things like that so my first impression when it came to using the dream junction I was very impressed because because I felt like they print it very well or whatever they're using is working super duper great so I really love this um, I am super thankful that it came out so like it came out so vividly I just can't I couldn't have had a better you know view when it comes to my shirt so this is is the dream junction okay so again direct the garment it's gonna give you that grainy look you might have some holes just for the record I have washed this shirt a couple times so that also plays into effect on how often you wash your DTG shirts it does still last long but there might just be some you know just some areas that may look a little like worn than others so just keep that in mind okay so that's the dream junction okay so here's Swift POD now this one with no color just white text as far as on the design and if we look a little bit closer you guys can still see that grainy more textured look just because of the application of how DTG is okay and so when it comes to this one from Swift POD I actually was impressed with this as well I feel like I could have layered my design a little bit better to be honest with you guys and what I mean by layer the design when it comes to pretty much having a really pigmented design 
All I'm saying is, is that I could have basically just like copied the design and like placed it on top of each other. So that way it's more like opaque. You know what I'm saying? And so anyway, this is what Swift POD like came out. This is the shirt and I think that it's still delivered very well. I really don't see too many discrepancies. I hope you guys can see this well also. Um, and so for me, kind of understanding how this goes, this is typically what shirts are gonna look like when it comes to direct to garment, okay? So again, not sure what your expectations are, but I just wanna assure to you that this is what your shirt is going to look like. So if you are liking what you see on my t-shirt and you wanna keep moving with print on demand, then it looks like, or maybe it sounds like, expectations for you are gonna just be realistic. And so I hope that you know these close-ups really gave you that idea of how your t-shirts can look as well. All right, good people. So that is the end of today's video on comparing different print providers, specifically the Dream Junction and Swift POD with Printify. I hope videos like this are helpful, you guys. And if you know these videos have been helping you, then go ahead and leave me a like so that way YouTube can recommend these to other people who are wanting to start their passive t-shirt income business as well. Thank y'all so, 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 so much for watching today's video. As always, don't forget to drink your water, mind your business, and always choose yourself first, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye, y'all.